as you all know, everyone knows I'm a sucker for love. I am. You know, I, I, aren't I Reg? I love love. Uh, yes. <laughs> the only thing I love more than love is loving love itself. That's what Guillermo wrote to me in his holiday card. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> um, and I love love so much, I'm constantly trying to find love for all of the young single people who work here on The Late Late Show. Uh, so with this is the start of a brand new year, a time, time to try and find some brand new loves for someone in our staff uh, who doesn't know that this is happening on the show right now. <laughs> It's time to surprise a Late Late Show employee with the gift of love via a game of live Tinder. Now, <laughs> the person we're surprising tonight has been working on the show for, uh, for over a year now. She's, she's terrific. We love her. She lights up the room, the hallway, wherever she's hanging out, and we, and we love her in there. Uh, and we're going to take the camera over to her now, and we're going to say, um, hey, Jenna, <laughs> how are you doing? Good. <laughs> We, did you have any idea that this was happening on the show tonight? No. <laughs> Are you okay with this? Are you ready to find love this evening right here? Sure. Oh, <laughs> Jenna, I need you to come down. Come down to the stage right now because it's time to play Late Late Live Tinder. Hurry up. Are you okay? I am the most camera shy person ever. That's why I work behind the scenes. Well, you are shaking so much. Is this all right? We're going to have fun. We're going to yes, find love tonight. Gonna you fun. okay with this? Yes. All right, when we come back, we're playing Late Late Live Tinder with Jenna. Come on back. <laughs> here, everybody. Jenna, how are you feeling? Have you forgiven us? I've forgiven you. I will stay. Um, I'm excited now, actually. Yeah? Yeah. Good. Well, so we, we, before we begin, let's get to know Jenna a little. So, Jenna, you actually moved here to Los Angeles from New York for this job. Yeah. Yeah. Which, we couldn't do it without her. Do you find dating in Los Angeles easier or harder than New York? Oh, it's much worse. Really? Yeah. Why? I feel like everyone here is so into themselves, or everyone's trying to shop you a script. Oh, like, really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Wow. And now, let's hope none of our men are from Los Angeles. <laughs> uh, all right, well, let's find out. Let's see if we can find your perfect match right here tonight. It's time to play Late Late Live Tinder. <laughs> OK, okay. <laughs> here's how the game works. Guys will come out one at a time into this screen here. You will take your big foam finger, you will swipe right <laughs> if you like the guy, left if you don't. Okay. Guys who get a right swipe will take a sweet seat on one of those chairs just there. Guys who get a left swipe will be forced to fall into the ball pit <laughs> right here. Now, swipe wisely, because only three guys will make it to the next round. Okay. OK? So let's get started. There's your foam finger. If you come and stand just here, let's bring out our first contestant. <laughs> Well, look at Stu. That is, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to say, that is a strong start as far as I'm <laughs> concerned. I mean, come on. <laughs> that hair will grow, so don't worry. <laughs> It's a cool haircut. You think that's a cool, think is that a cool, cool haircut, haircut yeah. nowadays? Really? Yeah. What do we think of Stu? Kind eyes. Kind eyes. Clearly works out. He does. Lot of working yeah. out there. Look at those arms. <laughs> he's like showing them off too. Yeah, he is. Yeah. He's going full Batman. Yeah. That's what you do when you've got guns like that. You've really got to put them out there. <laughs> Lovely smile. Good smile. What are we thinking about Stu? Oh, look at that! <laughs> Yeah. Now, I should tell you that even though, even once you've filled the seats, mm -hmm. if, if you fill them before we've run through all of our guys, you can make 
a bold move to switch someone out. If you see... So don't worry about thinking, oh, I don't want to fill them up until I've seen everybody. You can, you can make a switch, OK? okay? Which will really this damage great, someone man. for a long time. <laughs> but, Jenna, that ain't our problem. All right. <laughs> Let's bring out our next victim, I mean contestant. <laughs> wow, look at Trayvon. Oh Is it Trayvon or Travon? I think it's Trayvon, right? Trayvon? Trayvon? Trayvon, I, I would think. Although I think if that was my name, I'd tell everyone it was Trayvon. Trayvon? <laughs> Travonier. <laughs> so he's 32. I mean, 32. Again, also I've, looks like he works out. He does look like he works out. Uh -huh. He's made a choice with the goatee, but that can change. <laughs> we can change that, you know. Easy fix. Maybe it's easy fix. Oh, he's got dimples. He's, oh, he yeah. has got dimples. He's got dimples. And a lovely little smile there. So far, he's laughed at like everything we've said. He's laughed at everything. I mean, he could have dressed up a little. That's my. <laughs> You knew you were going to be on TV, Trevor. I mean, what do we think? What do we think, audience? Do we think this is right or left? Right? Right? right. Is it... Oh, Trevor! <laughs> Let's bring out our next contestant. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did we find these guys in GQ or something? <laughs> I mean, is it, does that say Grant? Is it Grant? Yeah, Grant. <laughs> Ding dong. I mean, <laughs> super cute. Might be a little young. Really? Yeah. Are we saying 27 is a little Might young? Might be a little young. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Reggie thinks so, too. Are you agree, do you, Reg? You think he's too young? I, I think a little bit. He's a cool guy, but he's young. He's a bit young, right? <laughs> oh, he's oh! gone! <laughs> he's gone! Yes, great time. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm... Honestly, I'm swiping right on Grant every time. <laughs> <laughs> Let's bring out our next contestant! <laughs> Now, Craig, that is a lovely face. <laughs> a lovely face, beautiful eyes, only ruined by the fact you did this. <laughs> <laughs> you look like you woke up in a coma behind there and just couldn't <laughs> believe that we were here. Uh, what are we thinking? Good jacket, I will say that. Good jacket, Good and jacket. he is older. He is older, yes. He's older. Is that more the age range that we're looking for? That might be a bit too old. <laughs> Jeez, Jenna. I... God, what are we looking for? A three-month window? <laughs> God. What are we thinking about Craig? What are we thinking about Craig? There's only one seat to fill. Oh, he's gone. I'm sorry, Craig. I'm sorry, Craig. A lovely dismount, though. A lovely dismount. Let's bring out our next contestants. It's, come on, no. Let's, let's talk about Kane. What do we think about Kane? It is a bold jacket. Bold jacket. Very bold. Kane, can we see what that looks like with the collar up, please? No, the collar. <laughs> I mean, I just... He doesn't, if he doesn't, he doesn't know what a collar is. If he doesn't know what a collar is. I just, I don't know how we can't be with someone How's who doesn't know what a collar is. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Kane. <laughs> It's the right choice. It's the right choice. It's the right choice. <laughs> Let's bring out our next contestant. <laughs> well, I love the name. I... <laughs> I love the name. Welcome to the show, James. <laughs> what are we thinking, Jenna? How are we feeling? Cute. Very cute. 29. 29. It's like right in yeah. that three months. Right in that window. <laughs> right in that window. Right in that window. Kind face. Looks like he plays guitar in a cafe. He, I would. <laughs> or I'd... writes poetry. It's one. It might be it both. Could be it both, could actually. be both. I don't know who. Oh, he, look at that! <laughs> yeah. All right, let's 
bring out one more contestant. <laughs> Hi, Dan. Dan. I like Dan. I like Dan. <laughs> I would hold Dan for a lifetime. Dan's cute. Let me tell you that right now. I would let him hold me until Trump... <laughs> no, I would. I'd let him hold me until Trump is no longer the president. <laughs> he's got that face. Good shirt, nice jacket. Very kind face. I'm worried he's got weird hands. <laughs> They seem like average They're hands. fine, they're fine yeah, hands. Like but the question hands. is, Jenna, do we prefer Dan over oh. James, Travon, or Stu? What do we think? Oh, this is so mean. It's not mean, there's nothing mean about it, but would you swap Dan out? What do you think? <laughs> do, you don't have to, I mean, what do you... <laughs> I mean, he's funny. I mean, James, I'm sorry. Oh, James, you're gone! <laughs> Before we start, let's let the guys introduce themselves. Say hi to Jenna. <laughs> Say hi to Jenna and tell us where you're from. Let's, yeah, give us one of those. Let's start with you, Dan. I'm Dan, and uh, I just moved here from Chicago three days ago. So. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Dan, <yeah. laughs> We're really falling into the LA stereotype for Dan. <laughs> I literally landed three days later. I was on TV. Um, <laughs> All right, Trayvon, what do we think? Uh, I'm Trayvon, I'm from Compton, California. Yeah. And Stu. Hi, Jenna, I'm from Wisconsin, actually. <laughs> Stu is from Wisconsin. <laughs> so, so, Jenna, uh, you can ask one question and each of the gentlemen will answer that question, okay? okay? So, uh, what is your question going to be? Um, when is the last time you ghosted somebody? What is ghosting? Is it me? <laughs> what? <laughs> It's when you don't text back, you just stop responding. Oh, jeez. Yeah, wow. it's brutal. This is telling us more about you than it is about them, I think. <laughs> um, so, uh, Stu, when was the last time you ghosted someone? I like to say, honestly, I never have. My mama raised me better. It's a good line, Stu. <laughs> it's also bull <laughs> <laughs> All right, Trevon, what do we think? Uh, I also never ghosted. Uh, I'm a big personal character, so, you know, I didn't want my character to be bad, so I've always kind of kept in contact and mutually split or something. <laughs> good answer, good answer, but he did do this a lot. <laughs> And I don't know if that means it's a lie <laughs> or the truth, but quite annoying. All right. <laughs> Dan, when was the last time you ghosted someone? Okay, so it was uh, about... <laughs> just straight into it. Uh, about a, a year and eight months ago. Uh, <laughs> in my defense, she brought up her ex and conspiracy theories in the same first date, and so I figured that was a good place to leave it. And <laughs> I'm sure she has some... All right, so now it has come to crunch time, Jenna. You have one person to choose to go on a date with. Okay. Who is it going to be? <sighs> All right, well, OK, OK. But I do love these two ladies here who are so passionately going, Dan, 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 Dan. <laughs> All right, what do we think? Jenna, who are you going to go on a date with? Um, I'm going to go on a date with Stu. Oh, Stu! Oh, <laughs> OK, come this way. You stay here. You stay right here. Hi, Stu! Stu meet Jenna. Jenna Hi. meets Stu. Hi. 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 Yeah. Well, guys, congratulations, Stu. Thank I am you. telling you now, we have spared no expense for your date. We are sending you to down the hallway right now for a date in one of our most romantic sound stages in all of television. 
Have fun, you two. We are going to check on you later. Ladies and gentlemen, Stu <laughs> and Jenna, off you go. You head this way. We'll be right back. Now, shall we take a moment and check in and see how our date yeah. is going? Oh, hell yeah. Right. We're looking. So we need to be very, very quiet. We need to be very quiet and just, just listen in. Let's see if they're saying anything interesting. We were ill last weekend. Oh, cool. Uh, went out with a buddy of mine. Um, <laughs> kind of a nerd, play some video games, a lot of yeah. few things. Oh, my brother got um, the mini Super Nintendo. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. We're playing that over Christmas. It's going That's big like on video I games. I that. Mm -hmm. I can, I, so. I think my mom still has all the original consoles. Um, <laughs> so, um, Super Nintendo and Nintendo. Okay, See? well. <laughs> <laughs> frankly, I'd rather listen to paint dry. Um, <laughs> Joined by Jenna and Stu. Now you just went on your date. Now Jenna, everyone is dying to know how did the date go? Is he the one? <laughs> <laughs> I think it went really well. Neither of us have been on a blind date, especially on television. Mm -hmm. So that's something. Yeah. Um, he's really into sports. Um... <laughs> was it, tell me, was it, do you? Did you like him? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you look like you don't believe me. We listened into your conversation for a bit. It, <laughs> it was quite boring. <laughs> but if you're into that, <laughs> did you feel like you hit it off? Was the chemistry good? I would go out for a drink, yeah. I'm planning. <laughs> Well, that's amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, we have found love and we are going to send you both on a proper date where you can actually get to know each other. Stu and Jenna, everybody, we'll be right back.